Hey, Michael B. here from uh, Code No. Uh, here to do a quick demonstration with QR codes. Uh, reading, writing, generating, the Flash, AS3, Flex, and uh, of course, Android. So, what we're going to do with this application is we've got our Flash face, which is actually going to generate our uh, custom QR code. And what we're going to do here is use a custom Air 2.5 application built in Flex. Uh, running on Android to actually scan that and uh, do whatever we feel past that point. So right away, uh, within the application, I'm just going to sort of generate a uh, randomized QR code. And uh, all we've got here is the event name and the ticket number. The ticket number, of course, is the uh, unique ID. And within our Android application here, what we're going to do is, uh, of course, start up the application. And right away, you can see we go into full screen, and all we've got here is the uh, video portion of it. Uh, we've got two buttons, one which is uh, just a reset button here, and uh, and of course the close button. So go back into the application, um, and again, because we've already uh, uh, generated cart, we're just gonna I'm just gonna scan this quickly, and as you can see, it does read. So there's the uh, quick reader code and the numbers that are coming through. Hopefully you can see that it's matching up. Um, again, if I just clear that, generate a couple more random numbers, you see how quickly this actually scans. And notice the uh, lack of latency um, actually on the video portion. Uh, I've seen a lot of QR code readers that are actually out there, and what they're doing is generating a bitmap on each and every single frame, which becomes quite labor-intensive, especially if you're running it on something as small as an Android device.